All right, y'all, what's going on? What's going on? All right, so today I am eating some barbecue pulled pork sandwiches. And so if you're new to the channel, please, please, please subscribe to the channel and subscribe. Even if you aren't, if you haven't subscribed, definitely go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Hit that bell so you get notifications the next time we post a video. Leave some comments down below. Let us know things you like to see us try, things you like to see us cook, interact with us, cook, do like to use me. We're going to say, Eric, get started. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for this food that we're about to receive for the nourishment of our bodies and health. In Jesus', Jesus name we pray, amen. So I put these little babe, put the uh, pulled pork in the crock. Piz naive while I was whiz naive and is naive, you know, while I was out and while I was working, and then I had to leave. And so I'm just not coming back. I did have breakfast today, but I did not have any lunch, so I am hungry. Okay, so I may or may not eat both of them. So I got a brioche bun, I got my pulled pork, I did put some cheese on top of the pork, and then. I put the coleslaw. There go your friend over there with that wall. What? Yeah, that's nasty. <laughs> So what y'all going? What's going on with y'all? You know what I'm saying? How y'all doing? We were on a family call on Wednesday and my brother's best friend had mentioned that or some I think he just said I don't know if he said that he was possibly gonna make it or had already made it. I maybe and maybe it was chicken and barbecue pull chicken sandwiches. And I was like, Oh, that sounds good. Maybe he was about to make it. And so I was like, yep, that's going to be the next thing I make. Put that down. You ate? You ate your food? Mm hmm. 
It's been a little minute since I had them. Oh, I'm going to tell y'all. I was in the crow ghetto, okay? The other day, I don't even know what I was getting. I mean, why I went. I think I was getting stuff to make cookies or whatever and some other stuff. And I was grabbing, um, I had grab. I need, oh man, look at me. I think I wiped some stuff on my, I had grabbed a bottle of ketchup. It, it was, it's not this bottle, but I grabbed a bottle of ketchup, right? So I didn't look at it and I get to the checkout and I pick it up out of my cart and was about to, no, no, I think I had already rang it up. And I look at the bottle and it was a big old gangsta spider on the dang on bottle, y'all. I don't even, I think the spider was probably gone at this point, oh, dead at this point, but still. Just the fact that it was super, I mean, it was like one of them big old spiders that had a little booty on it, like that, like a little bubble butt on it. I feel like that's how you know that it was a big spider, you know. Uh-huh. I let on a little squeal and dropped the bottle. More so, probably threw it. And there was a guy checking out in front of me, him and his girl or wife or whatever. She wasn't at the register at the time. And he came, I was like, oh my gosh, there was a spider on the bottle. And he was like, oh. And uh, the spider had, he kind of like, I, I don't know if he flicked it off the bottle or if it just fell off the bottle after when I had threw it and it fell on my water. Because I had got two packs of, you know, bottle of water or whatever. And so he kind of was trying to get it off my water, but I think it was like already dead. And it kind of just like, it was like real, like a flimsy, like it just kind of slid down the water. I don't know if it's probably gross to be talking about while I'm eating. Or while you're eating. So my apologies. <laughs> I, have been, keep, I have been forgetting to tell y'all about this. That made me, I, it just really freaked me out. I don't like bugs, and spiders are definitely one of them. Can you imagine if I had walked that spider home? <laughs> you know, sit up here and play with the plate and keep pulling it up and then mad at me when I take it away. Mm -hmm. You ain't eating nothing no way. <laughs> My coleslaw made it with broccoli slaw, and I just, um... <laughs> I, like, now that I know how to make coleslaw, uh, like, from scratch, I'll, well, I don't mind, because I still do buy the stuff in the container, because it's just easier sometimes, but, um, you know, you just get some apple cider vinegar and some, you know, Miracle Whip mayo of your choice or whatever, and you can add a little sugar if you want. Sometimes I don't always add sugar, I did today, but you just need... Some mayo and a couple tablespoons of apple cider vinegar. And when you say apple cider vinegar, it kind of reminded me of Sophie East because I was watching her uh, sea moss video. Uh, she was saying that she can no longer do stuff with apple cider vinegar in it because she should take it to the head. And it does have a, fair, a very strong taste, but... And I did used to just take shots of it too. I don't think I used to like put it in anything, even though you they you know really frown they advise against doing that. But but I'm with Soulful East on that one. Like, who want to just keep? Drinking a whole cup of tea with apple cider vinegar in it, you gotta taste it in every bite versus just taking a shot of it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
but I'll show you it is strong. Um, yeah. Mommy. Yeah. Mommy. Hmm? Mommy. Hmm. Here you go again, y'all. Ah. Well, you can't get out of here yet. Yeah, wait a second, Bubs. But I mean, the last couple of days, I would say probably I've been not skipping lunch, but shoot, that's because I ain't been knowing what to cook. Like, I mean, I have, you know how you be having stuff like it don't be a full meal. You be having one thing and not the other thing or whatever. Uh, man, it's been snowing. Oh, I ain't really. I don't really care about driving in the snow. I just like, felt like going nowhere. But it's just like, yesterday I was just like, dude, you gotta go to the store. Like, you literally don't have, I don't even have, I ain't had no leftovers in the refrigerator. Like, because uh, this week, I had most of the videos that you've seen, <sighs> excuse me, this week have been pre-recorded, so haven't had to record a video, which means I don't know what I'm going to eat. <laughs> I did. I'm mad about it now, but at the time, yes, last night after I got, after we went to the store, I came home and I ate, we had canes, me and bubs, but I didn't record a video. And that is just unlike me because I don't miss an uh, um, opportunity to record a video, have a video, but I don't know. I just wanted to eat. I just wanted to eat my food. And I was hungry because it was another, it was another point where I hadn't, uh, I don't know why I put all this right here and I only got two tater tots left. That's it, man. Bring y'all for now. Put all the stuff on my floor. Um. <laughs> no, you gonna throw it on the floor. <laughs>
Hey, now here. Mama. 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 Papa. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. Bubba's really on the train. Mm, I'll need to come get you, man. Okay. I bet I have something else to tell y'all, but. Bubba. Oh, my dad just told me a joke. He said that he heard, heard on the radio and he was quite tickled. It's actually pretty funny, so I'm going to tell y'all. What does a person who lies do when they're dead? Mm -hmm. What does a person who lies do when they're dead? Lie still. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Get it, get it. Yeah. Dembry old buns is the bomb, man. You know, on that no, I gotta go because he done took the beard off. Nana. Well, y'all, that's it and that's all. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Leave some comments down below. That's some things you like to see us try, things you like to see us cook, interact with us. If you like to hear from me. And subscribe to the channel. Like, subscribe. And hit that bell so you get notifications the next time we post a video. We'll see you in the next one. Peace out. Also, I mean, in most places it look cool, but like, like looking, getting a closer up it looks better, but like I feel like back here it just looks like my hair is straight and like just in place, but that's okay, so I'm about to put these in place.